Hi, Craig Morley here, doing my monthly Morley motivational moment. Many of you may know that uh, I grew up in a large family. I was the oldest of 13 kids. And being from a large family, fixing food became a, pro a project. One day, my sister Chrissy had been asked to make some cookies for the family. Well, with lots of kids, you had to double or triple the recipe, and as Chrissy began to put all the ingredients in, she had put in all of the sugar and the chocolate and the butter and the milk and all the good stuff, and she discovered the mixing bowl she had wasn't big enough for the flour. Chrissy, being a very practical girl, did not want to dirty another mixing bowl. And so she thought, you know, how, how good is flour anyway? How important is it to the recipe? It doesn't taste very good by itself, and so she decided to leave it out. Well, needless to say, the cookies did not turn out very well. Turned into these little rocks of burnt sugar. It occurred to me that life is an awful lot like the recipe for making cookies. If we follow the recipe that God has outlined for us, including all the ingredients in the appropriate amounts, mixing them the proper way and cooking them the certain uh, as required, that the outcome is pretty good. But when we deviate from the plan, we end up with a result that simply isn't what we hope for or expect. In this case, Chrissy thought that the sugar and all the sweet and yummy stuff would be enough to make the cookies taste good. Life is an awful lot like the cookie recipe. Most of the things we do in life are filler. It's the flower of life. It's the things like reading scriptures, saying our prayers, going to work, doing the routine things of the day that give our life substance and help us to have a fulfilled, good life. By trying to only seek after the sweet and the things that we think taste good, we oftentimes discover that our life's journey does not end up the way that it should. I'd like to encourage us all to follow the recipe that God has outlined that will give us the kind of outcome and results that we hope for. Thanks for listening.